Hey guys, I'm over at the house now um, on Santee. I think that's how you say it. Uh, beautiful day outside, not a cloud in the area. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, this street is nice. I like it because it's short. And you're not gonna have a whole lot of through traffic on it essentially. Um, so it's pretty quiet. You do have the lot next door with this one and across the street you have a vacant lot. Uh, nice little house over here, nice one there. Uh, the road coming in, uh, I think it was Auburn if I'm not mistaken. Um, has a lot of really, really nice homes, and that is right at the end of the street right there. That is Auburn. Um, so you're in a great area. Uh, I didn't do a whole lot of research on this home yet. Um, I've actually had quite a few people reach out to me in regards to this. So I wanted to get this over to you as soon as possible. Um, quick tour of the outside. Looks really nice. It looks like it has so much potential to be anything you want it to be. Um, finding parcels of land this size is hard, hard, hard right now, so it is really cool. Um, I'm not sure, I'm assuming it goes to about these posts right here, in this post, uh, would be my guesstimate. So you have all that to play with. If you ever wanted to add like an in-law suite, uh, actually I think it already has one. If you wanted to do another one, you could what they got back here when they have fences like this i usually always find pot growing back there let's see what they got i love my job very nice area um, i will say this home is wood framed as well um not a too big of a deal not too big of a concern uh nope no pot <laughs> happens a lot though you'd be surprised um I think they left this unlocked too, yeah. No, it's, what did she say? Maybe the front's unlocked. Mm. Uh, but again, yeah, um, the home is wood framed, but I did see up front, I don't see them over here. I did see some termite protection up front, I thought. Um, but I'll double check. Oh wow, this is huge. And it has power. Sink in here. Oh, this could be a little mother-in-law suite, honestly. Uh, maybe not. What's that? Is that mold? That is definitely mold. That is 100% mold. Oh, God. I'm getting out of here. So we got some problems with this. We got some caution tape, I'm not sure. Um, might be more mold, I'm assuming. I don't want to get too close to it. With the baby coming and stuff. Yeah, we got more down there. Oof. Uh, looks like we got more over here as well. Another hole up there. So maybe this building isn't um, really that usable. I would definitely be advised um, I've never successfully sold a property with mold on it because the mitigation and removal of it is so incredibly expensive um, if I'm not mistaken they charge like $40 per square foot of air um, of the total volume of the room it's crazy uh, how expensive it is but it's just a shed so not that big of a deal um, I was saying earlier, termites for wood framed homes. I see this right here, these green things. These are bait traps essentially for pest control. Um, if they start getting eaten by anything wood destroying, they will get those before they get to the house. Ugh. This house needs some work, that's for sure. There's another one there. There's another one there. So, okay, so they got termite protection, um, which is good. Down there. Backyard. What's that? Oh, this guy's got a sweet little setup over here. Cool. Alright, we'll go inside. Um, actually, let me just... These videos take a very long time to upload sometimes to YouTube. Um, so I'm actually going to end this one here. This will be the outdoor experience. And then the next one I will upload for the um, inside. So I'll be right back.